Johnny, the meeting's about to start. I'm good. I don't know what to think about Ronnie. Today's the first time I've ever met him. I mean, what about Ronnie selling $10 million of real estate last year? I mean, the guy never even leaves his house. I mean, he's like Mr. Rogers. Who would you be my neighbor? <laughs> Where do you do business from? I work from home. <laughs> I converted a closet into an office in my home when the pandemic started, which was the same time that I got my real estate license. So it turns out I've never once been inside this office, but I did do 10 million in sales my first year in real estate. Never seen him in person. He just worked from home, that's it. And sells $10 million in real estate a year. I don't understand. <laughs> Should we cheers? Cheers, yeah. please. Cheers. Ah! There we go, clink. Clink, clink, up. Is that a mimosa? I've had five. Yes. Um, so I met Patrick when I reached out and I was looking to shadow him and just get to know the real estate business a little bit better. Um, we had a really awesome day of driving around in his Porsche and I figured, hey, if he can put a couple of years into this and get a Porsche, so can I. I'm on the team and I work in the Charleston market and I'm here for whatever this is. Um, um. Probably the first week that I ever worked with Patrick. I was really nervous trying to like impress him. And the first house I was with him, would go in there and it was virtual. I think it was a virtual showing. And I have the camera and I fall down the entire flight of stairs going forward. And it, the person on the camera, they're like, is everything okay? I was like, oh yeah, I'm fine. And then I do it again, the same time in the same house again. They bought the house, by the way, they, they did buy the house. For the listing appointment, the white or these? Who gives a Um, nothing really annoys me, but he's got like a weird thing about his shoes. Hey, Rebecca, Zoom meeting. Can okay. Can get on the Zoom now? Yeah, is that cool? Yeah. Okay. So first I'm gonna, I'm gonna, the reason I asked you to hop on Zoom was to ask you your shoe, uh, which shoes I should wear for a listing appointment. Do you think the yeah. white shoes for the listing appointment or or these shoes? I don't think anybody gets a So Patrick and Lale, they've known each other for a really long time. But if I have to hear one more story about them in their 20s, I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> hmm. Patrick, can I yeah. tell the story about that night we drove to Charleston? No. How about the story when we were in Myrtle Beach? No. What about that wedding in Kiowa? Uh, no, definitely not the wedding in Kiowa. Um, what about what about all those nights at play? I don't think I'm allowed to tell any of those stories. I'm treating the team to lunch. Yes, 15, 12.30. Great, thanks, we'll be there. I've only hit one curb and it, nothing happened to the car, but I have hit three potholes and got two nails in the tire. But I can tell you one thing, I've never got a ticket, okay? The call and the hawk is still attached to the surface. Oh my god. Where's Allie? Where's Allie? She's a bad bitch, okay? She walks in here and she does not care. She will say whatever about whoever. She's just like, she terrifies me a little bit. Allie's desk is so messy. I cannot stand when I walk in and her shit is all over my desk. I mean, I don't understand why Lolly gets so annoyed when I put stuff on her desk. She's literally never here. That's prime real estate. Um, yeah, I don't know what the issue is with Allie and Lolly. There's just like always drama between them. I don't know what it is. <sighs> Get your stuff.
I mean, we've got Lolly and Allie. Uh, they feud. What we got to do again is Lolly. 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 Oh, I say her name wrong all the time. Did you finish your uh, maybe some cream corn? The place what did you have to do? Oh my gosh, they're all perfect and sweethearts. But I'll tell you what, I heard that one day Hannah drove in my place for Patrick. She drives horrible. No, that's my job. What the hell's a lie doing off? Really? Yeah. I'm not a bad driver. I just get nervous having to drive Patrick in the Porsche. Like I drive a Jeep Wrangler. I'm like running over curbs and driving the Porsche, I have to be very careful. I just get nervous. I'm like 10 and two, very slow, like in the left lane going five miles an hour, super slow. But I think I'm fine. But again, I'm not here to drive him. I'm here to sell real estate. Check out these pictures from Palm Beach last weekend. Oh my gosh. <laughs> well, I'm very particular with my Instagram. I have over 10,000 followers. I, I try to keep the people who I follow down. And I just happened to miss when Forrest followed me on Instagram. The next time I'm in the office, Forrest comes to my office and says, hey, Anna, like, why do you not follow me? Well, I didn't know I wasn't following her, but obviously it bothered her. So now I follow her and it's all just horses and plants and weird pictures of herself. There's this lovely little horse named Charlie out in this acreage. You know, he's a big old boy. He's been growing big and strong. He's about 17 hands tall, if you know what that means. So this guy actually looks kind of like my Charlie at the horse farm. I kind of hate her, but it's only because I wish I had her hair and she knows it. I literally give me the check, but I'm not paying for this. Find someone to pay for it. Like, what? Yeah, like she literally said. I wish I had that compliment. And she also. <laughs> See, I said nobody checked on me, but you did. I did. I'm You're the only friend that checked on me. Well, I was, my dance was over. <laughs> <laughs> What's Ronnie doing out there? COVID. Probably selling another house. I don't need to go inside. I can enjoy my coffee perfectly fine out here. There's no reason to go in. I mean, what are, what are they saying about me? I mean, I don't mind being roasted. They could say whatever they want. They could talk about how fit I am or how much real estate I sell, how cute my kid is. Like, I don't care. They can say whatever they want. Some scratches. I didn't know. I always order kids' meals. I, I've all, always have ordered the kids' meal because. Did you see everybody's plate? I love her, but Beth, I don't know what she's saying half the time. We were at appropriate the other day and we were talking to the seller and she was just going on and on. Bless your heart, this, bless your heart, that. And I just stood there because I didn't know what she was saying. Cool. What? The murder so house. Murder? So, okay. murder. Murder. Up. Murder. Okay. Yeah. Dead. So, I had these buyers awesome. come down like... from Southern Indiana, yeah. Indiana. So, I was telling this guy at the pub that I read an article that the most successful agents are women with an accent. Like, the word murder? Murder? What do you say? Matter? How do you say Patrick? Murder. You say T. Well, yeah, but that's different. Like, a murder. Murder. No. <laughs> A mirror. 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 Yeah. Mirror. A mirror. Yes. <laughs> I mean, people think we hate each other, but we're actually really good friends. Yeah. Okay, tell me if you think this is too harsh. <laughs> yes. Well, what am I supposed to say? Not that. Well, then you write it. <laughs> Does anybody want to talk about the f real estate market?